What's really amazing about living in the Uwana Basin are the collaborative communications that happens in the partnerships that we see between all of the different entities. The partnership with uh, USU, Uwana Basin, and UB Tech uh, from Stratus perspective involves a, a, a contribution of about $140,000 over a three-year period. It includes um, programmatic support for each entity as well as scholarship monies. You know, to have Strata as a willing, uh, supporting partner means everything to the community. USU's land-grant mission is to help the communities in which we live in. We're serving students uh, that are going to end up, we hope, working for Strata Network someday. It all started with a conversation of how can we help each other? How can we help our community? How can we give back? And it's just flourished, and we're really excited to be partners with Strata. We're all pretty aware that the, the workforce, the global marketplace, is changing dramatically, or, and has changed dramatically. And more and more, there's a growing need and a demand for specific in, you know, skill sets in IT, networking, security, cybersecurity, automation. And there's a, a notion around the Yona Basin about growing your own. And this is one element that it applies. We're, we're, you know, Strata and other employers are trying to grow their own employees, so to speak. And we have three IT certificates available, and these are in partnership with Strata. We were able to get that feedback and learn what does a student need to perform these different functions. We want to see the UNA Basin become a, a unique skill set of IT professionals that can work from anywhere, um, leveraging Strata's fiber network and providing skills and services to an employer, frankly, anywhere in the world. At UB Tech, we really feel that education changes lives. We have seen it. But I think it really embraces other people's notion of coming out to the UNA Basin someplace rural and to learn that they can do things here they can find employment opportunities here. They can find the broadband with here, just like on the Wasatch Front or anywhere else in the country.